Okay, now we're going to have a look at some hints and tips to make getting dressed a little easier. Often if people have um, a bit of stiffness or pain, particularly in their hips, their knees or their shoulders, getting dressed can be quite painful and quite uncomfortable. So there are just a few simple bits of equipment available on the market which takes some of the strain out of that. So first, Brenda, I'm going to get you to use the sock aid. Okay, there are a variety of different types available, um, but this is a fairly simple one to use. So the idea is that you pull your sock onto the sock aid. So once the sock's in place, as you've demonstrated, you take the ends of the long straps. So that allows you to drop your sock to your foot without the need to bend, pop your foot in, and just pull on the straps, which will pull the sock in place and the sock aid will come out the back, allowing you to lift it off at an appropriate height. So now you have your sock in place, the next thing we would want to do is perhaps put your shoes on. Now we can use a long handled shoe horn which would make the process of getting your shoes on a little easier again without having to bend down. So using the shoe horn, pop your foot in. Now these shoes have velcro on them so what you can use is a thing called an easy reach. This has lots of different uses but it can certainly be helpful um, for a number of aspects of getting dressed and one of those is fastening the straps on velcro shoes. We'll just catch the end and just push that across and that's now firmly attached. Also available if you have lace-up shoes you can get elastic laces so again that would basically turn your shoes into slip-ons. You could use your long-handled shoe horn and that takes out the need to bend down to tie your laces. Now Brenda we're going to look at dressing your top half. Um, if you have some restriction in your shoulder or elbow movement or you've got poor grip then there are just a couple of pieces of equipment, a few techniques that can make that a bit simpler. The first one is to look at if you have one arm that is weaker than the other, particularly say if you've had a stroke then to dress that side first is a lot easier. You can then use your stronger arm to help pull it up and over as such. Okay, and then you will be better able to reach round with that arm. What you can then do is you can use a dressing stick, which you can then use the hooked end to just catch the back of the cardigan. Again, using the arm which has more movement, or you could use your easy reach again. And then you obviously then have more movement in that arm to be able to put that on. Okay. Again, to take it off, it can be useful to use the dressing stick just to push the garment over your affected shoulder. That's it, and just hooking it round. Perfect. Okay. Okay, another um, area of difficulty that, that people often have, particularly if they've got limited movement in their hands, um, if they've got arthritis, can be doing buttons. It's the small fiddly items. So a simple piece of equipment which can help with that is an item called a button hook. A little bit like um, a, a kind of crochet hook really. The idea is that it pops through the button hole, you catch the button and pull it through. That's so. Um, and equally it can be used for undoing the button, it's just the reverse of the procedure. So this time we're catching the button and pop it through the hole. 